Hi guys, this is Joel with Guitars United, and check, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. We are at the Winter Nam, and we're at the VGA. Is that how you pronounce it? Yeah, VGA. It's like the letters V, G, and A if you were drunk. Cool. Yeah, awesome. French people talk like drunk people, you know? <laughs> Everything slurs together. Actually, they've been very cool. This is DJ, and he wants to show us some of their new products for 2015. And uh, you know, we also have a local artist. His name is uh, Tony Smother. We want to give a, a shout out to Tony on. Uh, I love for Tony. Yeah, he's he's a, he's a great guy, no doubt about it. So DJ, what do we got here, buddy? So uh, what we got here is GV Rock on uh, a, a brand new finish and shows some of our. Uh, on that. Cool. Shows uh, some of our new features this year. Uh, for 2015, we introduced the Revolution line of matte finishes for the GV Rock. So this is uh, matte black. We have uh, Revolution Yellow Matte, uh, which is a limited edition. Uh, comes stock with uh, black hardware, which we haven't done previously for GVs. Revolution Green Matte, Revolution Red Matte. And, uh, you know, the, the matte colors are cool. Uh, it's something we haven't done for the GVs yet. Uh, and what I like about them is it hugs the curves of the GV a little bit better. It accentuates some of the, the unique uh, features. Very cool. Um, you know, our little cutaways here and here. I uh, like this satin black. That's, that's awesome. Yeah, and the... Uh, all the GVs have maple tops, so we wanted to show just a little bit, you know. It's Beautiful. like an Amish, Amish girl showing a little ankle, you know. Just a little, <laughs> you know it's there. Um, it's crazy. Yeah, so the GVs for the uninitiated. It's an alder body with a maple neck and a maple top. Uh, all the wood we use is air dried for three years before we even cut it. Then we do a rough cut, we join the body pieces, and it um, sits for another year to let the glue set. And we're so backlogged on wood that most of the stuff that's being shown here is uh, the wood is seven or eight years old before it even becomes a guitar. So you start with super resonant, super stable piece of wood, and then we build from there. And we use proprietary hardware. Uh, we have a proprietary neck design. And I'll show you some of that stuff real quick. Uh, this was introduced along with the GV, our uh, proprietary stop tail piece, uh, bridge and stop tail piece. Everything locks. There's no sharp edges, so if you're palm muting, it's really comfy. Love it. And the bridge locks to the post, the tail piece locks to the post, and all six. Uh, saddles lock where they're at so when you pull all six strings off for whatever reason you don't lose your intonation the bridge doesn't fall off and get scratched whatever we have uh, custom amber pickups for all the GVs uh, uh, excuse me for the GV rock and wood uh, the ambers are great they're like a medium high output um, super clean and clear and they split beautifully they, you really do get the best of both worlds between humbuckers and single coils with these guitars uh, we use stainless steel frets on all of our instruments. The rocks feature a uh, rosewood fingerboard. Um, up here we got our zero fret, which we've been using for a long time. And uh, I love those. Yeah, and the cool innovation we introduced this year is the zero fret S. So you can actually see that instead of one fret, it's actually six little frets. Because even though they're made out of hardened stainless steel, um, they do wear because of the constant pressure. So now instead of having to uh, replace the entire zero fret. If your B goes out, you just replace a little B1, whatever. Um, we have brand new uh, chrome embossed logos this year on some of the instruments and uh, custom oversized locking tuners, which adds just a little bit of mass to the headstock, give you a little bit more sustain. And uh, our neck design, which I'll show you on the next guitar, uh, is really where the, the mojo lies for fishy A's. I'm gonna turn these guys down and then we'll go on with the rest it, of it. It doesn't matter. <laughs> sure? Yeah. Excalibur Custom um, in a brand new finish called Mysterious Red. Last year we introduced Mysterious Blue, Mysterious Green. It's our first real foray into uh, a series of bursts, and um, it's cool. They they're Beautiful. they're really sexy. Uh, the burst is, is kind of subtle, so it uh, gives just a little bit of movement to the top, and it just I don't know it sets everything off. So what I can show you here is this is our uh, geez look at that dust. It's our 1090 neck system, so it's 10% carbon, 90% maple, no truss rod. Huh. I don't know if you can see it on the camera, but there's the carbon fiber. It goes straight through to the board, so you never have to uh, never have to set it up. Uh, we've been doing it since 1988, so we know it works. Never bends, never twists, never warps. Heat, humidity, cold, dry, different altitudes, whatever. It's perfect. Huh. Yeah. I've never seen that. That's really cool. Yeah, and another cool thing is that all of our bridges uh, pivot on needle bearings instead of knife edges. So. Um, we get everything manufactured by Schaller for us, and we install these these needle bearings, uh, and then before putting them on the post, and the needle bearings never wear out. Uh, it won't fall off of the post uh, or slide on the post like a knife edge would. 
you get silky smooth action. So even on our Floyds, you can pull all six strings off, and as long as you're using the same gauge and tuning, it'll go right back to where it needs to go. You don't have to worry about it. That's awesome. Yeah. Um, so sure. A couple guys jamming in the back here, you sound really good. This one's sold. So right here we got the Excalibur Special. This has a couple other unique uh, features. This is the mysterious black finish, which is new from 2015. Um, again, it's just a new burst. It's a little bit darker than our old uh, black diamond finish, which we still offer, but I, I like this one a little better myself. That's beautiful. Um, and just like on our Floyds, Traditional trims, pivot on needle bearings, and they're so stable. Um, so the bridge is more likely to return to zero with the needle bearings. It's a zero fret, a Teflon nut, and our uh, proprietary string retainers. This, in my opinion, is, is every bit as good as the Floyd, uh, with a lot less of the headaches of installing strings on your Floyd. Huh. Um, but you know, some people just think they need a Floyd, so that's they, that's what it's they buy. Been out for a long time. So. Sure. Um, and this year, what we also introduced for these for these trims specifically is these little string dampeners behind the nut. So sometimes, you know, your string might get caught in the nut or something, and when you're really rocking on the whammy, and uh, it'll make a little ping or some horrible noise in the back. Uh, so the string dampener kills all that. So I'm seeing a lot of innovative stuff here, man. No doubt yeah, about it. Yeah, and every year we have new stuff. I mean. One of my favorite things that we do is uh, strap buttons, which we've been doing for a while, actually countersunk in brass casings so they don't strip out. So it's a machine screw? Exactly. Huh. So, you know, they're players' guitars more than anything. They're meant to be played and beat and, and rocked on, and that's what we hope happens. That's beautiful. What next? Yeah. Uh, pretty much it for guitars. Uh, back here we got uh, the excess bass kind of pickup upgrade, but that's about it. Cool. That's awesome. Yeah. PJ, thanks for your time, buddy. Thank you, Joel. Yes, sir. Thank you, Guitars United. And what is your website, buddy? Uh, VGAUSA.com if you're in the States. If you're outside of the States, VGAGuitars.com. Of course, How do you spell it? V-I-G-I-E-R-G-U-I-T-A-R-S.com. VGAUSA.com. Of course, uh, Instagram, Facebook, YouTube. Find us all over the place. Thank you so much. Oh, thank Appreciate you. It. Cool.